What it do, 32 gang? It's your boy CJ on 32. Back with another video, guys. Want to give a huge um, shout out to everybody that called and checked up on me. Shout out to the whole 32 gang. Um, I definitely appreciate y'all. Appreciate all the prayers, man. But y'all already know the grind don't stop, man. We're going to try to make this the best day I can make it. I'm going to stay productive, stay busy. Um, give y'all a quick update my mom's I actually seen her and went to the hospital yesterday and uh, I don't wish that on nobody guys like all them tubes and it was horrible and it's even horrible you know everything with COVID you can't um, have your family in there so you know my family was willing to come up there and just be in the parking lot but I, I didn't have them come because it's just it's not the same as being in there with me so so I manned up, I went in there and seen her and dealt with what I had to deal with. She actually, um, her body actually rejected dialysis yesterday because her blood pressure was going too low. Um, but when I went to the hospital, you know, after they done that, her blood pressure was back to normal. So they gonna try again today. Um, hopefully she can handle it today. But if not, then know I, I gotta take the next step so you know the next step is gonna be taking her off uh dnr do not resuscitate if her heart stops so um, at this point as hard as it is i can't be selfish you uh, know i gotta do what i gotta do and my family stand 100 percent behind me i haven't i haven't made the wrong decision yet as far as um the decisions I had to make throughout my life and my mom and uh she's been a fighter guys and this ain't something new but this this was the worst this was like the worst so you know I still got faith and uh you know hopefully by a miracle uh, she can pull back through because I love to just have uh one last conversation with her but you know even if she don't I'm gonna stay strong and I'm gonna do continue to do what I gotta do Keep, keep moving forward guys like I ain't y'all know my videos uncut uh, edited you know I don't let y'all too much in on my personal business but when I'm going through something like this I gotta tell y'all you know if, if I'm not super hype and going crazy in my videos y'all sense when something wrong and I feel like the 32 gang family I also have some trolls in the comments like <laughs> saying some crazy shit man like some of y'all on the internet is wild and bad man like that's I hope she die and shit like that Everybody gonna die You know we I don't know who you is Hiding behind the internet But guess what Karma a bitch Karma is real And karma a bitch So You know just cause I don't see you Don't mean God don't see you So Keep playing your games man You know everybody gonna die You gonna die Your parents gonna die That's one thing in life That you promise is death So You know it ain't no escaping it But uh once again, guys, shout out to everybody who called. Shout out to the whole 32 game. Shout out to everybody who support me and rock with me. You want, I mean, through the hard times and the good times, man. So, you know, I'm going to just keep pushing. I'm going to keep doing what I know how to do, and that's grind. So, I'm going to keep grinding. Um, keep trying to motivate y'all and just show y'all, like, you can overcome anything in life. I didn't make it this far to just give up and quit. So, I'm going to keep pushing. I know I got people depending on me. I got people out there that watch me that I motivate so it ain't no days off guys it's just absolutely I can't do it you know it's just I gotta keep going no matter what you know because the world gonna keep moving no matter what you're doing I could be at home yeah in the bed crying and depressed you know I have my moments when I break down but I ain't finna sit at home and just cry when I could be out being productive so you know my mom would want to see me um, active and out as I always been so that's what I'm going to continue to do. Thank you, everybody. Appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Appreciate the support, man. Catch y'all in a minute. It's been a long time. It feel like forever since I've been to the clubhouse. But today, y'all going to get the video that some of y'all been asking for. Which one do I prefer better, the Trackhawk or the Durango? I haven't spent time with the Durango. And I still, I actually went online in this short time that I started vlogging and decided to shoot this vlog to see if... The Durango is locked. Y'all know Dodge usually lock the vehicles until you hit 500, but it got a new 
info, infotainment center council in there so it's just completely different now and i couldn't find it i haven't even shot videos of this thing yet since really since i got it back you know i went out of town a little bit right after so we're gonna see today what's going on man what's up my boy what's up my boy chilling 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 how you feeling man you yeah, already know, man. We just going through the motions. That's how we do it. Get through it. But we make it through, man. You know, the 32 sure. gang family going to be behind you. I'm behind you, you know what I'm saying? So, For sure. it's all love right here, baby. For sure, man. Pull this track hawk out. I ain't started it up in a minute either. Don't wait to see this thing next to the Durango. I still, the track hawk just look better to me anyway. It's like the best looking Dodge to me, bro. I, yeah. I got to go with the track hawk. The it's track hard. hawk look better it's than... It's a little harder. Yeah. Because, like... Compact, like uh, yeah, it's like smaller. Yes, yeah, compact. But that aggressiveness, aggressiveness. I think the Durango got them on the aggressiveness. Look at that front end, so mean. Nah, that front end. If you look at white, what would you say then? It's that front end. We gonna check. We gonna check it we're out. Check Let check me pull out, this yeah. out real quick. I got you. Me personally, I like the track off aggressiveness. But we keep, we keep that quiet. <laughs> man let me know what you guys think man i'm choosing the track hawk cj is choosing the, the, the durango all right guys we got them out man this might not be the driving video where i drive them and actually see which one i like the best because i got three hellcats so i'm basically gonna do the shoot that video with my boy stunner out here and we can you know take turns with all three three together but right now we're gonna do the durango hellcat versus the track hawk. So them pearls smacking today. But yeah, man, those pearls is definitely hitting today, ain't they? Man. Some pinkish glowing. And I haven't watched this. Man, this damn car make you fall in love, man. Damn, today it is smacking, <laughs> ain't it? Ooh. Hands down, best looking supercharged Dodge track hawk. Man, Nobody not, can debate that. It's not even an argument, bro. No. It's not an argument, dog. Nah. But we about to get into it, man. I'm going to ask you some questions, too. <laughs> yeah. That's what's up. Guys, it's definitely smacking today. Now, okay. You got your Hellcat Durango right here. Mm -hmm. I like the front. The front is... I don't know if it's the slanted eyes. It's just something about the front that's super aggressive. And then when you get to the hood, you got your intakes. You got your... See how it go up? Yeah, it goes up. It's kind of the same. It look, yeah, just look it like it's missing there. Yeah. But, and it got the lower, this lower spoiler right here. Uh, I think that, yeah, yeah, but it just got a oh, mean, mean I, look. I kind of see what you're saying, you know what I'm saying? It got the, it got, uh, yeah, it got like a mean look. It don't got look. sexy appeal to it. And now it don't we, got like, uh, we go over here to the track hawk. You know, it's just a nice, clean front end on it. But it do got, you know the hood scoops and everything and it is it's nasty too man but on the front end wise i think just because that's a bigger uh suv yeah it's bigger it, it got that more aggressive look to it now on the size it's kind of ah it's kind of plain <laughs> on the size but y'all got to think this is a third row suv this is this got two rows so you know you get to the side you got your 3D cat right there. 
2021, you got your SRT on the Brembo's six pistons. You got huge. Oh man, they might be the same size. I don't know what size them uh, rotors is, like 12s, 14s, huge rotors, man. This one was 14. Definitely the stop. Yeah. Over here, yeah, you got your Brembo's over here. 26 is spec good on there. This one kind of bigger. I kind of wanted to do a bigger size wheel, but I didn't because I'm not going to cut it. Like these right here, I didn't yeah. cut. I could take them off and put right. the stock back on, and it's a stock track hawk. Yeah. So, so with this one, you ain't going to have to do nothing, though, right? No, nah, not with 26s. Yeah. yeah. So, man, let me see who I like. I kind of I like the more... Um, you know the more body lines. Yeah, this why I more body lines. Yeah, oh, I like okay. the more body lines on the track hawk. But sexy, I like the rounder wheel wells on the Durango. You see how they yeah, square, squared, square, off. squared off? Yeah. Yep, yep. I don't know, man. I'm, me 32 gang. I'm all day on this one, the track hawk. CJ might be on the Durango, but I'm no nah, favorite hands down the okay, track hawk. Right, but right, just okay, comparing. Yeah. Yeah, little stuff a little bit. yeah little little comparison um what else track hawk got the durango on the roof the panoramic roof they should have put that yeah, I on top of the durango yeah. man yeah, there is no that? reason for a hundred thousand dollar suv yeah. to not just have a roof yeah, yeah they small. they slacked on that so that wind goes to the track hawk uh the rear let me see which one i i don't know man the rear kind of tough man i like them long lights yeah i was about to say the lights yeah, yeah. and they the both lights. got the top the like spoiler fin, fin the, yeah, yeah. Uh, fin thing. but one thing i hate that they did to the durango that they seen? didn't do that they should have did to the durango that they did to the track they put the quad exhaust look how much better why the, the durango don't got the quad exhaust yeah, I just yeah, yeah, man. That they, look at that quad. Yeah, they should have quads also. Yeah, no excuses for that. That's so, uh, I like the lights. I like the lights over here, man. Definitely like the lights. The the track hawk pushing out 707, the Durango pushing out 710, but it's more heavier than the track hawk. So, I think the track hawk gonna still be the winner. They both all wheel drive. And like I said, guys, I don't know if y'all could do some research. I searched the pages. Is the motor still locked or is it unlocked on these cars? You know, the Trackhawk and the Durango come with red keys only. They don't come with a black key. I'm not sure if it's locked. I checked the pages. I can't see if it's, you know, how in the Challenger you could just go there and you could put it on 595, 5, whatever. And then you could put it on 7, 707 or whatever. But can't you can't do that with this one i can't find it so let's take a look in the inside man take a look in the inside guys y'all know it's custom over there you know i don't want y'all to get on my head again about me calling that marble uh forged carbon you know they stitched this real nice like the new infotainment centers and all this gloss black they went hard with that the steering wheels seats everything pretty much the same but I, I like the way Dodge do they two-tone uh, seats. The stitching is excellent. I need to put my floor mats down, huh? This stuff is dope right here. You know you, how you got your area seats and everything all right here on the like council piece. Still got the same shifter and shit. I just hate it, bro. But I see why they did it, why they didn't put the, the longer roof, but they could have moved the stuff that's back there. You got your third row seating in here. So this definitely a this definitely a SUV you could take a trip with your guys and your family with right here and, and haul ass and enjoy. Cause it's definitely a lot of room in here. Now let's go take a look at the track hawk. Got some, let me see. Lift the back up, man. Yeah, I ain't lay them down yet. I ain't drove it. I got 60 miles on here, so. Yeah. It's nice. It's, a, it's nice, bro. Then you can let that down. You can let them seize down, too, so it's definitely nice. 
And we got the track hawk over here. Y'all know the track hawk inside is definitely customized. Uh, we got the white. You know, I guess this, you know, carbon fiber too. It looked like it. So, kind of, kind of similar, real similar. The way they got the doors played off. You got your white track hawk seats, man. Y'all know I custom got this customized and put in there. You're definitely right about the doors. So they I they look similar, don't they? Similar, like the, the speaker wheel, the yeah. little round circle on the door wheel. Yeah. So it's kind of like one just higher than the other. One. Yeah, I think this one bigger though. Yeah. Like it's a longer door. But but they pretty much made damn near identical look where the little speaker at and about it's basically the same damn door but i think because of the rango a bigger suv that the door is, is just made out longer but they looked as the, they look the same to me she oh okay yeah i see what they did it they put the forage carbon down here instead of up here but shit shit pretty much the same guys look it's pretty much the same um you got plenty of room back there too, but y'all know ain't nobody gonna be in here but me. You got uh, two rows. Definitely the screen and everything in the 2021s is better. They put the gloss black and the bigger screen in there. So it's definitely better. Lift up the back. Come on, man, you supposed to be going up on your own. Not without my assistant, then. Ain't no room back here because we got the speaker box and everything in the back back here, so. That's pretty much it, man. Now let's get to the real business of these. Why they so hot and everybody want one. I mean, these two to me is two of the rare ones. Everybody got a Challenger and Charger, so um, I like these better because it's less of them than the, the Challenger and Charger. So this is where all the magic happened at. You know, this is what everybody wants, the Supercharger um, on the 6.2. The Scat Pack got a 6.4. Now I'm in no form, no engine man. I can't tell y'all every single thing, but I can do my best. <laughs> I'm more into customizing. So when people say you should do something different and make make it a thousand horsepower, it's like for what? I'm never gonna drive it like that. So it's pointless. Y'all see what's going on, man. It's not a clone, guys. It's the real deal, Holyfield, man. They did a good job putting this in here, too. Yeah, they really should have put it in a 300, though. Definitely. It's on a Yeah. Man, they kind of look the exact same. It's like everything ran almost the exact same. It's crazy, guys. Don't it just look yeah, like everything? Look the way it's set up, too. Yeah, like everything damn near the same so pretty much where they got their blueprint print from look the box and everything like sitting in the exact same location sure yeah kind of like the same so yeah dodge know how to give people money man they know what they doing <laughs> marketing genius shabby man y'all should have took notes and chased uh horsepower but that uh ct5 uh black wing I watched some videos on that. That thing nasty. I think 668 horsepowers and it's light, super lightweight. But yeah, man. And I have that. Yeah, I don't even. This where the switch at on That's this right one is right there. Yeah. So there you go, guys. You got your Dodge Durango. You got your Track Hawk. Tracky track. Dodge Durango Hellcat. Track, Don't get it twisted. Which one y'all taking 32 game? Not just because it's painted. And that track hawk just. It's like one of the hardest Jeeps trucks ever made, man. Look at that. It's so nasty. 
And then having them pearls on there just make it. Ugh. Man, that video when you was riding down the expressway, you see how it was flicking? Yeah. Oh my God. They don't know, video don't do it no justice. I think this is the one I'm gonna take, take the taxes with me. Which one y'all driving, guys? Y'all taking the Durango or the Trackhawk? You know what's so crazy? I was watching the video and they was asking which one you bring to. But I'm gonna go to the shop because I, I still don't know what color on the wheels I want to lock down. So I'm gonna actually go over there. Man, bro, the colors right here. I know, you, you see, see them like, greens? It's like, it's like, I don't even see what you see. Come right here. Bro. You're gonna see. Like, look at Look how them greens just oh, hitting off. Yeah, right on top that of boy. Right But then when I get close, it turns yellow. <laughs> yeah, guys, I can't wait for the summer to hit, you know, get over everything I'm going through so I could really, I haven't drove the cars. Like, I just been getting by with videos of just buying stuff. Like, I really want to get out and enjoy it and bring y'all, like, different type of content. It just seems like whenever you up here, it's always something that try to bring you back down here, but you, with me, I get stuck in the middle. I'm never going down here, you know. The only way the 32 game going is up, so... No, I gotta keep grinding and keep doing what I'm doing. No, we definitely gonna do a review. Matter of fact, we gonna get we gonna get pops, man. I gotta get pops in the Durango, and uh, I'm gonna do a review on all three Hellcats if y'all wanna see that. But where I'm gonna actually get in them and drive them, guys. So we gonna head over to the shop, man. Appreciate you helping out with the video. You got your daughter with you? Yeah, man. She What's up? Getting my car washed right now, so she just chilling, telling me she's yeah. cold. <laughs> cold? Yeah, I'm usually the cold. one cold. Right. Y'all know he in here getting this car wash you've been posting. Uh, yeah, yeah. 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 You know Tell him your YouTube channel. Uh, AB underscore in that thing. Um, you go follow me on there. Subscribe to my um, my YouTube and also follow me on Instagram. AB underscore in that thing. Yeah. That's, That's right, real. guys. And y'all see he ain't get on my camera talking about shout me out or this my YouTube channel or none of that. Uh, so, that. yeah. But uh, <laughs> also... I unfollow everybody on social media, guys. I think the only person I'm following on social media, CJ So Cool, don't take it personal. I'm just going through something right now. And I don't want to see the negativity, the competition, and the competing and all that gay shit on my timeline. So that's how I'm rocking right now. You know, I, I deleted Messenger off Facebook, all that stuff. So, you know, I'm only attending to my YouTube business as far as social media go. This the one that paid me. So all that other stuff, like I said, don't take it personal. I just... I just don't want to see it, so respect it. See what we got going on in here, man. Car wash. Car wash? Yeah. Oh, there go Miguel. <laughs> Your car over there. Miguel, what's up? Hey, what's up? <laughs> you right there getting laced up. Yes, she getting you laced up. You know what I'm saying, <laughs> That orange thing. Miguel in here working hard. What's up, man? You ain't miss me? <laughs> How you feeling? Okay, how are you? I'm good. How business? Picking up? Yeah. Weather picking up? Negative. Yeah. Yeah. All right, I see you, man. You got a house full of cars. Y'all already know, man, if y'all need to get a car wash or a quick detailing. Amigos, right here, complete auto detail. What's the number? Uh, 815-730-7896. Yep. Make sure y'all hit my boy Miguel up in here. Get you right, man. You see, we getting the scat pack right over here. Is she gonna get the CT5 right for me? Yeah, because you was filthy. Definitely was. Nasty. But uh, we about to jump in the uh, Durango, guys. And, oh, excuse me, take a ride real quick. I'm gonna actually take a solo ride now that I got, you know, my camera thing I, I like using. I'm gonna come back over here later on and put it up. But I'm finna take a ride in it right now. We're gonna stop by the shop. Cause I'm trying to figure out like if I wanna go brush rims or if I wanna do red rims or all black rims. Not all of them came off. That's the thing that I was scrubbing it. What's on there? Uh, I'm, I'm thinking that I don't know. Oh yeah, it's hard to get it off. I didn't wanna keep See, you got the lights in there, man. Okay. I see your RGBs. Yeah, man, I'm trying to look something. What happened to your plastic on the, over there? You see it right here, right? Yeah, it's popping out. Yeah, right. You gotta push it back in. 
Yeah. I didn't probably, want to touch that. You probably could go from underneath and just push it from the back. Yeah. Okay. They don't want to push it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Who did the lights for you? Uh, my man LB. Uh, okay. Cool as I see you. That orange is fiber. Okay. Change this out. Nice yeah. lip in the back. I'm gonna change that out because I got my decals in the trunk. You know I never put decals on my car. I know, I know. That's why my, my girl was talking to me about that. She was like, baby, I don't think you should do it. It's, 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 like it's too clean. Yeah. <laughs> Only logos I got on my vehicles is PC ass. He was like, what the hell? I saw <laughs> he was like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You got to be clean, man. It's too dirty, huh? Um, I didn't really want to be scraping it. This is this terrible. It has a lot of emeralds. From her, uh, from the yeah. back. I'll be telling them not to put too much. Yeah, hey, when you clean the, yeah, when you clean the lac, no, no armor off. Yeah, that's yeah. right. But get me right though, cause I, I'm probably mounting it up today. So, okay, I got you. yeah. All right, bro. I'm about to head over to the okay, shop. All right, hey. Uh, tell your pops call me when I can pick it up. Okay. I got you. All right, thank. Ooh wee. 2021 Rango. Dang, do I got my thing in here? Probably don't. Yeah, I got it in here, guys. Let me set up for this ride, cause. We're gonna hit a block. This is my first first time really finna hit a block. I probably stopped by the dealership real quick before we had the Al shop because I'm so confused on what color I wanna put on here. It's like, do I stay simple and clean or do I do it the 32 gang way and make it pop and make it stand out? You know, because to me the interior is not red and them bright red rims, yeah, y'all know how I am. I'm kinda, yeah, yeah. Them uh, twisted that I had in a couple videos ago that was all black with this color in there. They definitely match to the T. I don't know what route I want to go. We're going to decide that together, 32 gang. I think brush would be a good look. I don't got nothing on brush wheels. So we'll see when we put the wheels by the vehicle. Start this bad boy up. Ooh, okay, okay. You mighty quiet. I definitely got to smoke it out. I'm going to get on that, man, within the next couple of days or so. I just got a lot of stuff to get ready and prepare for guys but uh oh no you ain't buddy copyright me we're gonna hit the streets with this boy i know coming out damn i should have turned around coming out i can really jam it feel good being in here though like it's big it's a lot of room in here and uh you sitting up so high it don't feel like you got that you know dodge like to make longer hoods on their cars it don't feel like you got that oh they're going to Durango over there uh-huh just pulled up at the shop and there go another one over there it ain't no cat though <laughs> hold up hold up hit this turn right here i actually need to go to the bank that's what i need to do i don't know guys i'm not sure if it's locked i don't know i honestly can't tell you even when the red eye was locked i still felt like it was unlocked but I don't know, cause it's still fast as you know what. So, let's see. oh yeah, definitely. This thing got some go, 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 go. I ain't had no lamb talk in a while either. Just trying to stay uh, positive thinking and motivated, you know. Actually, right here, like the shop. My mom is in the hospital on the next block from the shop, so I'm actually passing the hospital. They still haven't called me yet. That's what I'm waiting on, but I'm just killing time, guys. Killing time. So. Take this right, right here. See if we can hit it down the street. Yeah, definitely throw you back. This boy definitely throw you back in your seat. I'm going to have to take it on the highway, man, but but I'm going to say that, you know, for when Pops in the car and we can take that ride, I'm going to let Pops uh break it in a little bit more. Like I said, I don't know if, if that 17 unlocked, but uh, if it ain't, y'all know Pops breaking that in. He been, he been texting me and calling me, so I know you watching this, Dad. Shout out to you. I love you. You know how I am when I'm going through stuff. I just, just isolate myself. Isolation. Head over here to the shop though, 32 gang, and see if we could 
pick out some wheels, man. Like, I already told them, I already got something in the work, but now it's like I'm double thinking. I, I just want to, you know, hit another home run. Like, I know either way it's going to be good, but I want the best, not just good. I want to settle for good. Yeah, man. Got some kick to it, guys. Definitely do. what Al in here raging about today see if Lee James beat him up oh yeah I know y'all seen the video yesterday he wasn't yelling at the employee guys he uh something happened with the machine and he was just mad they got it fixed though but he was he was cussing a lot but y'all already know man keep the footage raw and uh pretty much uncut and just take y'all through everything I go through pretty much for the day 45 minutes out the day 30 minutes out the day but once again, guys, thanks for all your prayers. I appreciate y'all, man. We just, we gonna make it, man. The only way to 32 game going is definitely up. You know, some people like seeing you. Some people like seeing you down and out. You know, I might hit the middle, but I'll never hit rock bottom. So keep wishing bad on people. That shit gonna come back to you, you know. I don't wish bad on nobody. I wanna see everybody win. If everybody was winning, there wouldn't be no hate. So, you know, I wanna see everybody win. I don't want to have more than you or none of that. I just I want to see you win. I want to see you be happy. But uh, the crown heavy when you at the top. Trust me. But when you working your way up, it's always some something or somebody there pulling you back down. You know, you just gotta stay strong. You gotta stay focused and maintain. You know, nothing's nothing's impossible to get through. So. All right, guys, M made it over here to the shop, man. I got the CT5 wheels right by the Durango. And now seeing the red there, I think this is the way to go. I might add like, well, actually these four Giottos, them supposed to be my floating caps, them Fs supposed to be been black. Like I don't want to overkill with, with black because that's the whole point of having a red, like a red bottom wheel. So the, definitely I had like the F and the four Giotto letters black, but I think I'm gonna go this same route because it looks so good, man. That's nasty, On the black, yeah. What we just talking about that concept? Yeah, that'd be, that'd be yeah. Nasty, and both of them next to each other, both black cars. Yeah. You know, you really won't be able to see the seats because I'm a um, tint the windows. So, oh, yeah. man, it looks like they already got the back. They already got the back windows tinted. They ain't dark. But they tinted already, straight from the factory. But I gotta have that five percent tint. And then also was thinking about, you know, getting that Hellcat emblem, the same color, red to make it really just pop and not do too much, not overkill. You know, just put a red that red emblem, and that'll be nasty. So yeah. Just something nice and customized, guys. So tell me what y'all think about that. I don't even think I want to put the brush or the black wheel there. I just think black is too, not 32 gas. It just be too much. Too yeah, much just ain't, ain't really smoked style. out. Yeah, not my style. I need something to pop. The brush will look good too, but the red, red gonna pop. Red. Yeah, the red is the red is <laughs> it, guys. Red, yeah. 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 At first I said the black when we was outside, but like. Like you putting a red up to it? Seeing it, yeah. I'm sorry, I ain't even said black. Yeah, that, that red is that red is it, man. And I ain't gonna get carried away, guys. The only other piece that'll go red would be the emblems. That's it. Same red. So I'm gonna try to work that out before Giotto and see if I can get them emblems red straight, you know, have them shipped there or whatever, because I want the same matching red. That's like candy brush red, and then you got the lip is different it's like a red chrome on the lip yeah. but these mugs pop so much and i don't think y'all really can catch it through the camera no, it can't it can't because oh. I, I saw it yesterday when uh, on the camera yeah. it looked better in person bro yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah them nasty should i put my mats down today it probably just need the driver down today Ain't nobody gonna be in the back i haven't even opened these man let's do this Quick unboxing then. Black. You wanna hold this for me? Okay. Check it out, guys. I don't know why they gave me this. 
No front plate ever going on. What the hell is this? Pad brake. Something for the paddle. What the hell is this? You know, I got one in my car too. You open it? Nope. I just, I like, I don't, I don't think I fucking need it. Oh, oh that's what that is. Look. Man, you better open them and lay them boys down. I ain't know. I got, I got, I got, I was like, Breaking what the fuck is a paddle, paddle thing? I'm like, what the fuck is this for? That's, that's dope. That's pretty dope. Oh, they black, black. They got the SRT on them. Oh, they got S? Let's see what they got on them now. Okay, they, yeah. Yeah, it's nice black. SRT logo. I don't know where the hell they go or how they go, but this look like a damn passenger side. So this one is like the back. But they did a nice, you know, white, white stitch and they tried to, they tried to make it look like something. It's probably like the middle, the middle mat right here. So these two definitely, definitely the front mats. What you think? This is probably the driver. Let's see how it flows. Gotta have mats down, man. I get tired of picking this damn paper. Oh, yeah, look at them paddle they just black. I'm gonna have to snap them on there. Already. <laughs> Whoa. Yep, this ain't the one. This definitely ain't the one. It's too wide. Oh. It's probably this. Yeah, the hole's closer. This gotta be it, guys. That's our teeth. So you ain't, so you ain't even lay the pedals down on yours then? Huh? No, no, they still in the box. I ain't know what Damn, the hell. It, it gave it a little flow. Let me check these caps. So bro got these too. Looks like they just. Kind of look like they just clamp on there or something. Oh, I think you, yeah. Do you have to take the regular yep. ones off and then put that yep. on? Oh, okay. I look way better too. All right, guys, I might have to figure with it fast forward these let me get these on and uh <laughs> we'll be back in a minute i don't want to just drag the video on showing me taking this stuff off but i'm gonna get them put on real quick you can hit the power button all right guys man hey epic fail on that them things are super tight super hard i give up on them i'll get them done a different day i don't feel like it today i put the original one back on but red it is what's going on bj you ain't got to do nothing, man. You over here talking. Yo. What's up, man? Ooh, what's we got the Nike do-rag on today, man. Deal. Red and black. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. We trying to get it. <laughs> How you feeling today? Man, I'm tired, bro. Y'all been running the crazy today? Uh, it's, it's been, it's been the a slingshot bit. gone? Huh? Y'all done a slingshot? Yeah, we did a slingshot. I see it's gone. Yeah, it's gone, gone, gone. Hey, what you think, man? We going red bottoms on the Durango, too? What side? 26? Yeah, I ain't doing nothing where I got to cut. Yeah, yeah. red bottoms. Mm -hmm. I messes with it. All right, red bottoms it is, guys. Definitely want to see what y'all think, though. My damn back hurt. What these going on? These ain't going on that lift, is it? What y'all doing to this lift car? What? This one, yeah. No, that guy just got 10. Oh, I just got tinted. Yeah, tint guy. Tint you already left. Yeah, I gotta get the tint done on here. Yep, put the original back on. It's a wrap for that, guys. Not gonna do it right now. These are so tight and hard to put on. So that's pretty much it, guys. It's a wrap for this video, man. Till next time, this your boy CJ on 32s checking out with another video. I'm out, man. Gang.